This video will cover the cleaning and valve lubrication for the Vortex TR and Vortex SPX spreader. Keeping the Vortex spreaders clean and lubricated is the most important maintenance step. The spreaders will get dirty while applying material. The valve will have dirt buildup between the moving and stationary plates. A dirty spreader will not perform as intended. The following steps will ensure that the valve and manifold stay clean and operating smoothly. Step 1. Start the engine and run it to full speed. Running the engine will force the soap and water to clean the delivery manifold and hose. Step 2. Lay the delivery hose on the ground. This will allow the soap and water to flow out the end of the delivery hose. Step 3. Run soap and water in the hopper. While the water is flowing in the hopper, open and close the valve to clean the valve plates. With the valve in the open position and the water flowing, insert the cleaning brush from inside the hopper and scrub the inside of the delivery manifold, making sure to push the brush to the bottom of the delivery manifold. Step 4. Wash the entire machine off. When complete, leave the engine running to dry the delivery manifold and delivery hose. Step 5. Lubricate the valve plates. Lubricate the points shown in the two photos. Do not use any product that has a petroleum distillate base. This will cause the dust to stick and create buildup. We recommend DuPont Teflon non-stick dry film lubricant. A 4 ounce bottle is available at Lowe's. There are other options as long as no liquid residue is left on the parts that have been lubricated. A few tips on cleaning and lubricating the Vortex spreader. A power washer is not recommended to clean around the electronic actuator. Washing with a hose is fine. The actuator is not designed to have a direct high pressure stream applied. This can force water beyond the seals of the unit. A putty knife can be helpful to clean in between the valve plates. This will aid in removing dust and dirt that has built up. The delivery hose can be removed and the manifold can be scrubbed in the horizontal position if a loss of flow is detected. Call us for instructions. If the valve is not opening and closing properly, most likely the valve is dirty and is in need of cleaning and lubrication. We cannot stress enough how important cleaning the Vortex spreader is to having a smooth application time after time. Most of our observations of units in the field come back to cleaning issues. We appreciate your purchase of the Vortex spreader. If you have any comments, concerns, or questions, please feel free to give us a call 954-650-7590 or toll free 877-886-7839 and we can be found on the web at vortexspreader.com